So I had to delete some video, so this is gonna be short. So this hole is way up high. It's, it's not really centered, but that hole was already in this frame. I could have switched that bracket, um, but I wanted to utilize this hole, which was in the frame, and if I switched it, this, the bracket is not, there's a little T on it right there. And this hole went in the line up, so we went with that. And then I had to drill this through the bracket and the subframe. So, and we're only going to go with three because Ford's got this big cutout right here. And it's, uh, I could squeeze a bolt right there, but I don't think I need it. There's just, there's three in there. It's hooked to the frame, it's hooked into gooseneck. I'm going to drill another hole here because it came with two holes one there and one there. But when I tighten this, I don't know if you can see it, this has got a warp to it and there's a gap right here. And I don't want salt and sand to get in there and rust that. So I think if I'm gonna put another bolt right through there. Maybe I'll put two and it'll tighten that to that frame. I don't need it for strength. It's more than strong enough, but it's just got that little bit of warp. They both did it. So I wanna suck that over so it's not, I guess I could put some caulking on there, but. I'll just drill it and put a couple more bolts in it. We ran out of bolts, and didn't give us another bolt, enough bolts. This kit said service body on it, so I don't think I got the right bolt kit, but most of them are working, so I just need like four bolts for that, and then I'm gonna need four bolts for that. So I'm short like four half inch bolts. It's not a big deal. Go to the hardware store and get them. So that's where we're gonna quit for tonight. I gotta drill some more holes and uh, and then we're going to get some more bolts. So that's it.